everyone, and here's our devotional for Friday, August 23rd, 2019. Lord, teach us to pray. I say to you, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and the door will be opened to you. For everyone who asks receives, the one who seeks finds, and to the one who knocks, the door will be open. Luke 11, 9 and 10. Jesus teaches that God answers prayer. Knock, knock. Who's there? When a doorbell rings, we answer it. When there's persistent knocking, we look to see who it is. And when someone begins a joke with knock, knock, we good-naturedly... Sorry, I'm bumping my phone. We good-naturedly respond, who's there? It's the natural response to a knocking at the door. The logical conclusion to a ringing doorbell. If someone is home, the door is opened. As Jesus teaches us to pray, he talks to us about the most mundane of occurrences. Someone's at the door. When the doorbell rings, we answer it. When we pray, God answers. It's as simple as that. When you pray, you ring God's doorbell. As you pray, whether silently or out loud, your request is heard and answered. Simple as that. We have God's command to pray, as the second commandment tells us. We use God's name properly when we call upon his name in every trouble, when we pray, praise, and give thanks. It is our duty as Christians to pray because our Lord has commanded it. And by, by praying, we give honor and glory to God as we use his name. Do you pray? God commands prayer. As with all of God's commands, we, okay, we have failed... Ah. Shut up. Okay, sorry. It's like everything's flying here. All of God's commands, we have failed the daily and daily fall short, yet through his grace, God counts the perfection of Jesus as our own. And today, Jesus teaches us that God always answers prayer. Awesome! Christian prayer is answered because it is offered through the holiness of Jesus Christ. Christian prayer is answered because God delights in giving to those who ask, supplying to those who seek, and opening the door when the doorbell rings. The fact that Jesus Christ has literally physically risen from the dead is proof when you knock on God's door, he answers with a smile on his face and the best possible response to your prayer every time. In these verses, Jesus teaches us that God always answers Christian fair, prayer. The faith God bestows at baptism ushers us into the throne room of God, where our smiling Father hears our prayers. The, perfe- the perfection of Jesus, given through word and sacrament, continues to clothe, up, clothe us as we ask and seek and knock, as we pray. Father, Knock, knock. (laughs) Teach me, Father, to understand your grace to me in the blessing of prayer. Remind me that you always answer and teach me to pray more often. In Jesus' name, amen. Wow, isn't that awesome? Praise God that he always answers. Isn't that awesome? Um, And we've got a kitty laying on the arm of the chair here, so we're going to pet the kitty. Um, Let's see, I want to... Oh, yeah, I remember now. So there's this song. It's like an old chorus, I guess. I don't even know if there are verses to this. If someone knows that there are, please let me know. But I'm going to try and sing it. Stop and touch the Lord as he goes by. You will find he's not too busy to hear your heart's cry. He is passing by this moment. Your needs to supply. So reach out and touch the Lord as he goes by. Do that today. It doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter where you are or whatever. Jesus sees you. He knows. Like that woman that, you know, had the issue of blood that reached out and touched the hem of his garment. I mean, I mean, in a crowd of people, Jesus still knew who she was. Isn't that awesome? He knows us too. So just reach out and touch him and ask him for whatever it is. And he really does hear. And may the Lord bless you all and be with you till tomorrow.